tell us in the comments. Don't forget to hit the like button and share this video with everyone you know. Oh. When I actually started painting in tote bag until that, I stopped monitoring. So in the morning, narinig ko na lang siya sa news because we're, we're, we're listening to a radio station as well. And uh, it helps me to be more calm at, uh, at this time. Yes. Ano? And uh, so natuwa na ako doon. So, uh, so wala pang ano yan, team yan. So basta ginawa ko lang siya dyan. <laughs> no? So wala pa siyang kwento masyado. And then sabi niya, okay, give a title. Color of life. Kasi makulay siya. Parang ganyan na kulay ng buhay. No? So uh, parang yung, yung dark sa baba, na supposedly mountain, sabi ko, yun yung mga darkest moments natin. But if we're going to look again uh, in a uh, totality, your life is really colorful pa rin. Right. Okay. This is beautiful. No? I love the colors. They're mm -hmm. very uh, joyful. They're very exuberant. The colors are very ex full of exuberance. Full of mm -hmm. life. They are very appropriate yung title na colors of life. Yes. And whatever color you are, whatever race you are, parang it's doesn't matter anymore at this point in time. Sino ka man, kailangan, kung kailangan mo ng tulong at may maitutulong ako, tutulong ako. So that's that's okay. what I want to, yes, to this, uh, this, this particular piece, I would just like to say, hands of hope, this is precisely the message that I love about your art. That it gives a very positive uh, message that uh, in spite of the dark, and very gloomy atmosphere that the pandemic mm -hmm. has created all over the world. The colorful hands of hope, the, even if we cannot hold each other's hands, humanity is connected. Yes, yes. And humanity, all the colors of humanity, you yes, know, yes. Mapa, mapa Filipino ka, Americano, European, in Czech, you know, sa dami ng kaguluan na nangyayari sa mundo, we are all spiritually connected. We cannot say that we are removed. We are, yeah. whatever happens to one part of the world, affects all of us. And I, that mm -hmm. is such a beautiful and a very profound message. Your mm -hmm. art, I'm telling you, I'm getting inspired. Every time I see your, your pictures, especially mm -hmm. itong Hands of Hope, all the more I see the depths of your go ano yung nandito at ano yung nasa puso. Mm -hmm. What is in your mind and what is in your heart. And yes. this particular piece, Hands of Hope, is so profound. Yes. Um, I've also learned that, although sabi nga nila, arts is actually the expression of the, the artist. It's a, it's, a, it's a one way of communicating um, what you believe uh, what are your values? Uh, what are what's on your mind? I think that the papasok din yung quality ng isang arts no. Na dapat ikaw mismo artist masaya ka. Alam mo yung yeah. alam mo na may quality yung binibigay mo at ibibigay mo sa tao. So Saka, ano, I think yung personal expression mo. Once nakita mo, you're the only one who can gauge. Once it's in a canvas. Yung kung ano yung hindi, hindi tugma sa vision mo for that piece. You are the only one who can say, oh, mali ito, kukorektahin ko to. You know, you're the one who will introduce the the editing or the changes or the, oh. the alterations. No? So, uh, director, kumbaga eh. No, yes, you are the director. You, one man, ka talagang, you control that canvas. Yes, correct, correct. No. So I just so, come to realize also that before you really um, hold on to the to a brush, you know, and start um, painting, kailangan uh, the concept is very very clear. The message should be very very clear from the start. Um, bakit ito? Anong mga kulay? Bakit itong mga kulay na to? Bakit gantong style mo? Bakit itong mga guhit, malapad? Lahat pala yan, may meaning. Kailangan yes. may meaning. Bawat, bawat stroke mo. So it's not that you know how to draw. It's not that 
I'm I, I'm uh, a graduate of uh, fine arts in this uh, university. Hindi siya yon eh, kasi yes. bubuk makikita mo yung mga artist na ang gaganda ng gawa. Pare pareho sila ng sinasabi. Kailangan bago ka humawak ng brush, buo mo na ang konsepto mo. Alam mo kung anong gusto mong sabihin. Ano, alam mo kung anong gusto mo, anong position mo. So uh, like like Joey in terms of surreal, uh, this uh, uh Michael, it's actually uh, sa baba kasi is a Republica ng Talk What Battle. But this is a social relevance uh, on what is yes. happening right now, no? Um, it's a statement and um, he knows he believes on his own um uh, stand in what's happening right now so sabi niya sa akin so so be it so you know if you want to be more spiritual if you want to be more motivating so be it ano basta alam mo lang ang bawat istorya ng obra mo wow. hindi pwedeng okay. nakakita kasi ako ng magandang bulakla kaya pininta ko so can you imagine a piece of your work in another's homes wall something na parang parte kanya parte para every time para pagising mo pa lang ma'am pag, naki, pag nakita mo yan naalala mo na agad ako ano yes. may connect may I know connect that feeling agad, very no? well. i know the feeling very well because i you know, i cannot say i'm a collector but i love art and i love uh i love books i love music and the things that i love i want them to be around me all the time because they bring me so much joy you know and and i know that when when that person bought this piece and is now part of that person's home there's now an intimate connection that 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 you have with your client through that art because parang your your obra touched that person's heart kaya gusto yes. niya ngayon maging part ng buhay niya maging part ng home in it's, it's 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 so significant to be in somebody's to be part of you know for a piece of yours to be part of someone's home. So it's a blessing at this time of pandemic that you you know um, I cannot um, uh, parang understand that you know at this point in time parang balang bibili talaga that's a hirap you know? but uh, sabi nga if it's God's will it's God's will. Yes, so, it's God's will. And it's your time na. Yes, yes. So, hindi ito toong, hindi tayo marunong. It's actually, we're just afraid to learn something new, to do something new. And, um, but this can be a very good uh, career also at the same time. And uh, a therapy at the same time. So, uh, wag kayong matatakot. No? Um, kailangan lang nating maging malakas na we have to reskill ourselves in this pandemic because there is uh, the uncertainty is still there we don't know uh, kailan tayo babalik yung bang career natin ngayon applicable and um, my just just advice that this is the right time to rethink and to retool yourself art heals let us always know and feel confident that there is the healing power of art. And stay tuned for the next episode. Only here on Z81 Radio, Manila.